onboard computers have primary control of all the vehicle's critical functions. T minus 20. 15. 12. T minus 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. 5. We have three main engines up and running. 2. 1. And lift off of the Space Shuttle Atlantis on a mission that will herald a new day of international cooperation in space. Houston now controlling. Roger roll, Atlantis. Atlantis is completing a roll maneuver as the vehicle turns into a head down position on course for a 161 nautical mile orbit and rendezvous with Space Station Air. throttling down now at 68% uh, of rated thrust as the vehicle passes through the area of maximum dynamic pressure. Approaching one minute into the flight, the orbiter is downrange from the launch site, three nautical miles, the altitude already up to 40,000 feet. Atlantis, Houston, go at throttle up. Three liquid-fueled engines are back at full throttle of 104 percent. The vehicle's altitude is approaching 70,000 feet downrange from the launch site, 10 nautical miles. Atlantis is already traveling 2,000 miles per hour as the vehicle passes through one and a half minutes into the flight. The next event is burnout and separation of the twin solid rocket boosters at about the two-minute, four-second mark of the flight. The most tense part of any shuttle mission is the first two minutes as Atlantis speeds up to 17,000 miles an hour. The is confirmed aboard the orbiter. Atlantis is downrange from the launch site, 32 nautical miles. Altitude is 170,000 feet. Traveling 4,400 feet per second or about 3,000 miles per hour. Houston, performance nominal. We copy. Performance is nominal, Kirk. Atlantis, Houston, two engines were on. Two solid rocket boosters were jettisoned at just Performance the right moment. Performance thus far aboard Atlantis has been as expected. The orbiter can reach uh, Marone in Spain in the event of a single engine failure. However, all three are still at uh, full throttle, performing in uh, excellent shape. The hydraulic systems aboard the orbiter are also in good shape, as well as the fuel cells providing electrical power to the vehicle. Passing through three minutes into the flight, Atlantis is 68 nautical miles from the launch site at an altitude of 260,000 feet, traveling 5,500 feet per second or 3,700 miles per hour.